Biggest takeaway for you from this reported reshuffle? Uh, yeah, so I actually want to put aside the whole uh, PBOC governor thing for a minute. And Go really, ahead. Yeah, talk about uh, Holy Fung, which I think mm. is by far and away uh, the biggest <laughs> announcement here, right? Mm. Or, well, sorry, uh, that's the report, right? We'll have yeah. to see, I think, at the MPC, you know, whether all this shakes out. Hmm. Because Ho is widely expected uh, to become uh, the vice premier in charge of economic uh, policy, replacing Liu He, right? Yeah. So yeah. Um, the idea that he could also be party secretary um, at the PBOC really represents that idea of consolidation of power that we've been seeing Xi Jinping really make over the you know last few years, right? Especially at the uh, the Party Congress last last year. Mm. Um, so really installing that kind of relationship between a party secretary at PBOC, also vice premier in charge of uh, economic policy, that's something that we haven't seen since the 1990s, and yeah. really suggests that we want to bring more of the financial sector uh, power and control under Xi's direct command um, so that he has more control over really what's happening with this $60 trillion financial system here. Does it have any implications for policy? And what does it tell you about the upcoming MPC meeting? Yeah, um, so certainly it tells us that at least in terms of reshuffling, we're going to see a lot of what we've already seen um, at uh, last year's Party Congress, right? Mm -hmm. So uh, we're just going to see more and more people sort of consolidated underneath Xi Jinping. Um, there's going to be more decisions that are being made by fewer people. Um, so I'd expect to see that um, in the coming weeks ahead.